We're gonna play a bit of Pal World. That was... That was fun. That Path of Exile stream was fun, but I'm definitely rage quitting after losing so much progress to a network error, of all things. So we're gonna do some quick, quick fun Pal World stuff. It also means I need to change the stream title. Cool. So we're back in Pal World. A little bit of stuff has changed here. Got some... Got a Vixie. Got a ranch here, to, so it can shit out some Pal Spheres for us. Because nothing better than Pal Spheres shit out by a Vixie. And we have some plans. We are going to go find some cool stuff today. This won't be, like, the longest stream ever, but it will be fun. I have 54 pal spheres. My weapons are destroyed. Great. <laughs> That's fair. Let's go into the dungeon here. Let's go into dungeoneering. We are level 12. That is going to change very quickly. I have changed the settings on the world a bit to better fit with this being a stream. Which means that things are going to get done a little bit faster. Because you've all seen the starter content in Pal World. Now it is time to do some of the more advanced stuff. But first we need to finish up the last few bits of things we need to do. Like, deal with that. We're gonna get some XP. We're gonna get some new pals. And we're gonna get a saddle for this deer. Because we badly need a saddle for this deer. Which is level 14. There we go. Cool. My people are leveling up. That's good. How's my recoil doing? Mostly recharged. Okay. One Mozilla. Let's do this. I think I've started to get a concept of how to find which direction's the right one. Think. This does not look like the right way. No, this is the dead end. But I don't think I have a Mao yet, so I'm going to get the Mao. Bring back my Mons so that I don't have to have it killing my stuff. Cool. This area is just complete duds, so I can just leave it. Ow, that was rude. Yeah, get back here. I'm gonna hide from the other fiddler for a second. Okay. Get him! Get him, dear, get him! 
How did? Where are you? Get out of the ceiling and attack the fuddler. I want whatever the boss is at the end of this to uh, perk my team up a bit, because I don't have any boss monsters on my team yet. I don't believe. No, I definitely don't. Okay, so that was a dud. Let's try this way. Uh, okay, is this the two hallways? Yes, okay, so this is probably the right way. This, I would usually not go this way, but I see there's another direction to go over there. Is that the boss area? I'm having a hard time seeing all the way through. Nope. That's a dud. Get him, dear. Oh, I'm already out of arrows. That did not take long. Give me coins. Get him! Okay, you are going to be aggressive. You're not already. Okay. I'm going to try to pack on as much XP as I can. I'm going to try to catch some of these because it's easier than killing them sometimes. Okay, not with that one. Is that the one dead? No, it's behind me! Okay, cool, 13. Okay, that's dead. Fine. It's 14 for the deer saddle, right? Alright, I have that. I just need to make it. Yeah. Need to take down a bunch of deer. To get some horns and some leather. Is this the right way? I think it's the right way. Yep. And we have... Oh my god! This... This is a dream come true, because the deer is my favorite of all of the... The pals. Oh my gosh, if I could get a boss deer, that'd be amazing. Unfortunately, unfortunately, they're incredibly dangerous, so I don't know if the, how well this is going to work. This feels like a really, really bad idea, potentially. I'm going to hide. I am not strong enough to deal with that boss myself, but my deer is. Okay, thankfully, they're not smart enough to get me. Oh, nope, nope, they'll be smart enough to get me from there. Okay, that's not smart enough to get up, though. I don't think. Okay, throw that down there. You two can fight each other. I'll bring you back up as soon as it's ready to catch, and I have way more than enough things to catch it with. Actually, wait. No, I'll use recoil on it. Okay. I don't actually know what goes against the neutral types. I 
I haven't actually found anything in particular that's good against them. I need to actually find a type chart for this game. Hit it one more time. Hit it one more time. Hit it one more time. Come on, there we go. No. Get back here. Okay. Can I do that? Yes, I can. It'll just roll down. Oh god, no. Stay away, Daydream. You will just kill it. Yes! Okay, that is probably the best thing that could have possibly happened in this dungeon. There's not a single power that I would have preferred to have over that. That leveled up all of my, my pals, too. It almost leveled me up again. Crossbow, crossbow schematic. That looks like an un, not an uncommon. That's a uh, rare? That's really good, too. Yeah, it's a rare crossbow. Oh my gosh, that's also really good. Okay, this is going to be awesome. Okay, where's our deer right now? The other one. This one's here. Oh, it's upset. Okay, well, I want to see what the boss deer looks like by comparison. Okay, where... Where's the other deer? Oh, he's probably at the... Uh, he's probably logging. Oh, it's right here. That is a interesting way to enjoy yourself in a sauna, but okay. Oh my gosh, you're so big! Oh, I love this. Oh, he's so awesome. Oh, he's so awesome. Okay. Okay, this is amazing. Nope! Don't run in there. Okay, so that's going to give us a huge boost, because my favorite pal now is a boss. That is so good. <laughs> now all I need is like a boss lift monk, lift monk or something. Oh, that'd be amazing. Or a boss recoil lift monk. Since I'm not going to make my deer a cannibal, I will give this to my lift monk as a reward for doing so well. I will give it to the deer, but again, I don't think that's proper. <laughs> there, you did very well, Al Capone. Okay, so, what's our next plan? Our next thing to do is to work on getting the saddle. So we need, oh, all we need is Paldeum for that. Okay, so that's our next goal right there. Okay, first of all, what I'm going to do is swap those for a second. And I'm going to sleep, since that will heal everything. My single player game is at like level 20 now, so I'm I've gotten used to how some of this stuff works. Okay, so I just need uh 5 Paldium. And there is 6 on this beach. Oh, my pickaxe is broken. That's the weapon that's damaged. Wait, where's my repair table? Oh, right, it's under the stairs. Repair. Eh, there's no point repairing my armor. It's just gonna get destroyed immediately. Everything does too much damage for that to survive. Unfortunately. The only thing that I've really found really matters is maintaining the shields. Especially the mega shield, which is really good.
So I don't get you don't get the mega shield level 18, but that's not too far away. Once we get the deer saddle, we will be able to do a whole lot of shit. There we go. Uh, okay, so... Handiwork. Who's the best for handiwork? Probably you, realistically. Oh, I want... I want to pick up you. Hold on. Okay, I want to swap these back anyways. Hey, you. Help me with this. Thank you. Actually, I have unused stat points. Let me up the work speed I have. Oh god, my work speed's awful. Yeah, I don't... Uh, I mean, my stat distribution isn't terrible, but it's not probably what I would do. In retrospect, I would have gone a lot more into work speed and weight. Would have... Health isn't bad, but it's not really going to help you till later. I feel like. Like, it's, it feels like it's worth up, upping health once you're past, like, 20. But early on, it's better to just have weight and work speed. You can do stuff faster, and you can carry more stuff home with you to do stuff faster with. This is the weirdest dance ever. Oh, I can make this much weirder, actually. Perfect! Wait, why don't we have ba Why does my deer think we have bad working conditions? Oh, no, they're happy now. Okay, they were just hungry. I mean, to be fair, I hate everything when I'm hungry, too, so if that makes sense. Okay, who wants to see me ride a fucking boss deer? Not me or you. Oh my gosh, it's so big! Oh! Oh, it's so big. This is amazing. Oh. So good. Gonna need to train him up. Okay, I'm gonna need. To, I'm gonna go somewhere else to do this though, because this is obviously not where I can train. Oh, I can fast travel without even getting off. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we should, uh, we're gonna go to the Rain Syndicate Tower entrance. We're not doing the tower yet. Because we're not strong enough. Straight up. <laughs> we are going to kill some stuff in this area now. Run aggressively. I wish I actually had a weapon. But I need to go to a particular spot to get a weapon. Or I need to go to a particular spot to get uh, arrows. Rather than crafting them myself, because crafting them myself is just a pain. Back here. Back here. Get him! I need- I actually need, like, a real weapon. This is awful. Okay. So, there is a waypoint... ...over here-ish. So, we're gonna go... ...up here. Alright, I can just ride now.
And this isn't just... There's more to this deer than you might imagine, too. They have the double jump. That's why I like them. Oh, Vixies. Nice. I'm gonna catch you. Very going to catch you. Oh my god, there's a Relaxosaurus. Okay, that's moderately scary. Uh, I don't know if I want to go up against that. They're really, really scary. Uh, actually, okay, no, I have a good idea. I'm gonna go this way. No, 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 no. Okay, when I said this was a good idea, I meant this is a good idea. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. What the fuck? What is, what is going... What the hell just happened to my body? Well, shit. <laughs> yeah, I kind of hoped that I could tank one hit. I must shield must have been down. Because I would have been able to tank a hit if it, if it was up. I did not pay enough attention. Oh, there's a Syndicate base there to raid. Okay, where did I die? This way. I please, yeah, okay, there. It wasn't letting me off. Oh, actually, I do want some rush ores. Okay, you... You captured? Yep. Okay, you're good. 14, great. Daydream, I need to get you off the team. You are so aggressive in a way that I do not want. God damn it. <laughs> yeah, that's why I do not like the daydream thing, unless you're specifically only going to kill stuff. Aw, oh, damn it. Oh, well. Okay, whatever. I do have a Vixie now, so we're good. Okay, I'm gonna give myself some more work speed. Uh... Oh. Spirit Fire, Shadow Burst, and Shockwave. Nice little set of things. Alright, let's get back on the giant deer. Kind of wish I had crosshairs, but I don't really have crosshairs with the big deer for some reason. Despite the fact that usually you have crosshairs with the deer. Whatever. Oh! There, maybe? No. Thankfully, the Vixie did not notice. Oh. Now I do actually want you to attack Daydream. Okay, that's good. Back you. Oh, that did not work. Whatever. I have to be kind of careful, because I am in danger now. My shields are down, and I'm low health. I'll have to recover a bit. Do I have a T-Font? No, I don't. I should get a T-Font on the team, because they can heal you. What is that? Don't know what that creature is, but I want it. Okay, 
right, let's, you know what, let's get off the deer for a second and send the deer out to do its thing. Yeah, no, you go cause trouble in the syndicate base, and I will stay here. Get him! Get him, giant deer! Get him! Oh my god, he's bigger than the cage by far. The only disadvantage to having a boss deer, it seems to be the fact that they are really, really big. And that can make it very hard to do things. Like, go through small enclosed spaces. Which, for this deer, is anything. What are you? I've never seen you before. What's that? A Dazzy. Often kind of lonely pets. However, the moment a pal mistakes this for actual companionship, it sees the opportunity to blast them with a thunderbolt. That sounds like another pal from another show. Another game. I think it's called Palamon or something. God. Go away, Fox Barks. Get him! I'll hide behind this tree. There we go. Okay, so there is a shop around here, actually. I believe it's this way. It's, it's over there, so I need to go around a bit. Oh, there's a bunch of shit happening here. Mark, why? Oh god. You just pissed off all the deers. This might go very badly. Okay, I need you to come back here for a second to guard me. Because I'm in danger. Hide! I am the weakest link! Uh oh. They know that! It's getting hard to dodge all this. I need to keep them both on screen, because even if they're not looking at you, they can still attack you. While, well, like... They can just, like... They can 360 you, I've noticed. It doesn't matter where they're looking. Hit with pickaxe! There we go. Get him! Oh, Daydream, you're doing work. Thank you. Oh, I am just so perpetually close to death. Hello, Merc. I don't know what you were supposed to... Did you have a traitor with you or something? They must have had a traitor with them, and they're dead now. I would assume. Come on. Thank you. I feed you anything. That was me. I can eat the, the deer food. Or the deer meat. That's fine. I don't want to feed the deer meat to the deer. That feels weird. I wonder if the fact that this deer is so much bigger than average means that it's going to be able to jump higher, technically. That's kind of great if that's true. Do I have a... Yeah, I have a parachute. Okay. Okay, 
Okay, so we are going to go get the settlement waypoint. We're going to buy some arrows. And if we can, craft ourselves one of that rare crossbow. Because crossbow tends to be good for quite a while in my experiences. And this is my favorite ore mining spot at the desolate church here. Wait, this isn't the settlement. Where's the settlement? Oh, it's down. Oh. Oops. Well, whatever. I need this for ore anyways. Oh, right. I'm a giant. I forgot. Megasphere, good. Effigy. Okay. Right. My capture power. Okay, let's go over to... Where's the fast... You know what? Actually, this might still be the fastest way to get there. Okay, it's this way. This wasn't where the chill it was. Otherwise, it's weird that there's just this big open spot. Nope. I would prefer to do more damage to it than that, but... Oh, it's just a megasphere on the ground. That's cool. There you are. Okay, so one of the benefits of Rush Shores, if you're not familiar, is that they have a charge ability, kind of like the Deers, except for it does extra damage to rocks, specifically. So, those that big area with rocks up there, if you use the charge ability, you can collect rocks much faster than you otherwise would. It's this way, isn't it? Oh yeah, it's where the uh, smoke is. Here we are. And this is where, like, the first big, like, reliable merchant is. Okay, so I need arrows pretty badly. Oh yeah, I don't have real much money on me. Oh. That's fine, because we have a waypoint right here. And also, we have a black market merchant here. You can sell pals to that you don't want. I don't need the lamb ball, don't need lamb ball. Don't need the fock. I do want a cativa. Uh, I'll sell some of that. Let's go back to home, grab the precious stuff that we got from that last boss. Come back here, get some more arrows. Where the heck do we live? Okay, yeah. Up here. There's going to be even cooler places for us to live, too, eventually. Okay. Oh, right. Everything's incapacitated, because... Fortunately, when you walk away from this area, like where your base is, and it unloads, the pals still continue to lose hunger, but don't do anything. So I don't know where they all are, they're probably underground or something, for all we know. Yeah, I'm gonna put the Dazzy in my party. I need a Rush Ore. Ideally, I want a Rush Ore that has speed increase. That's attack increase. I don't think that's what I need. 
none of these are the brochure I need, unfortunately. Ah, whatever. Place that Vixie. This is a slacker. I don't really... I don't really like that, but it's better than... Better than nothing. Acetated. Swap you out. Swap you out. And swap you out. I guess I'll place you with something, too. Why not? Well, those are the Mao. The Mao can be thrown into the, uh... Into the quarry over here. Or not quarry. Uh, into the ranch. And it will create gold coins. I thought you do ranch stuff. Do you not do ranch stuff? Yeah, you do ranch stuff. It says it right on you. Whatever. Okay, you are not doing this. Your job is to create pal spheres. Why are you here? Why can't I move you? Okay. Create me pal spheres, please. What? Am I only allowed one pal in the branch at a time at this base level? Maybe. That would kind of explain it. Okay, so... Don't actually need this stuff. Sell the ruby. What am I using right now? I'm using the tropical outfit. Get rid of it because I'll find something better later. Need my money. Put my pal stuff away. Okay, that I can sell. Not you. So does this decrease my health since it has no durability left? That gives 70 health. This gives 70 health. Wait, you still get the health benefit from armor? Even when it's broken and you supposedly can't use it? Okay, whatever. Sure. I, that's fine with me. Extremely weird, but whatever. Not you. Fire. I'll have them bake some beans while I'm gone. Beans? No, berries. Okay, back to the settlement. Okay, I'm gonna grab some more arrows. Oh, actually, we should check the black market merchant. I don't remember what they were selling. Oh, okay, there's nothing here I want. I don't have the gobfin, but in general, unless something's like so super cool that I really want it now, I generally try to find things in the wild. I just kind of prefer it that way. It feels better. I don't know. Uh, sure. I'll use all my money. I don't care. Actually, I have stuff to sell anyways, so it doesn't matter. Okay, so I got 2,500. That's not bad. This 
So for the rush shore, which I did not put in my inventory yet. I'm going to need to not punch my mic, first of all. We're going to need a saddle for the rush ore. And that's going to be heavily required if we want to actually use it to break stuff. Rocks, yes, break rocks. Mega spheres, sphere workbench, crossbow. Uh, we can skip most of the other stuff, though. Okay, so the... Oh, I think we probably need an upgraded workbench to create the crossbow, don't we? Yeah, high-quality workbench. So we need... Uh, ingots for that, which means, ideally, we need a rush ore saddle. Okay, just need some paldeum for that. That's fine. We can do that. And I'll show you the quick way I have of getting the ore. Why am I walking around? I have a deer. Is that enough? That's four. Yeah, that should be enough. Tingle it? What are you doing? What am I doing? <laughs> I need... You know what, whatever. You can stay stuck on the floor. Actually, I can just pull you out. That works. Okay. Yeah, you were starving because you were stuck in the floor. That tends to happen. Okay, rush our saddle. No, you're not transporting. You're helping me. Oh, nope. That's not what I meant to do. It's very hard to find the... To find the interact with this sometimes if you put your workstations too close together, like I have done here. Also... If there's someone helping you craft, there'll always be the interact to pick them up, which is a pain. Because the interact to pick them up is the exact same key as it is to work, as is to mount, as is to use the second mount ability, as is to interact with any chest. <laughs> kind of a problem. And you cannot disconnect those things from each other either. So that'll always be a problem until they allow they split that in the configs okay now we need a rush or we have brave hooligan glutton bottomless stomach destructive so probably this one i don't know if attack helps but we'll find out yeah i'm not using your right Okay, so we are going to go to the Desolate Church. This is also a great spot to find Rush Ore, actually. So. None are around right now. Nope, not you. Okay. Line them up. Reckless Charge. Eighteen or I 
Okay, so 250 weight. Oh, I got stuck on it. That's weird. Almost. Got 60 weight left. Okay, and my inventory is now full of ore. A very quick method to getting more ore. Let's run back to the waypoint here. Go back to base. Throw some ingots on. Leave it to wherever my fox is. Yep. And go back into repeat. There's a fair bit of ore there, so we will have a nice little bounty. Enough to make our crossbow and a few other things, probably. Okay, that's half our inventory already. Every rock you hit gives you a bonus. Or not a bonus, but like every rock you hit gives you three you can gather from. Fifteen, nice. Okay, we're full again. Back up to fifty. Don't make another twenty-five ingots. I'm gonna wait for this to finish on ingot. Cancel. Redo. Okay. 45 ingots going. Actually, I'm only one ingot away from being able to place the bench. No, I need a few more. Okay. That's fine. Let's do another run. See if we can find another rush ore, too. Eventually, we're going to have enough technology that we will be able to get the PAL Essence Condenser, which you use to combine multiple PALs. When we do that, we want to have a good rush ore that we can combine a bunch of things into, because it will help him... Uh, it will level up the partner ability, which is the mount to gather stuff. Gonna keep trying to gather some Vixies so we can find some ones. Well, ideally, want the Diet Lover trait, which will which will decrease the amount of food that they need when they're just passively at home. Okay. No, I don't want level five. Give me something. Let's try the new thing. Actually, what does this thing do? I don't know much about it. Ooh. Nice. Ooh, I'll catch you. Catch you. Bring it back so they don't kill the rush ore. There we go. Do one more run and then we can sleep for the night. If we're lucky, they will be done crafting the thing, the uh, ingots that we need by the time we're done here. Can you tell I've played a bunch of this off stream? <laughs> uh, I've been playing a lot of this off stream. It is really fun, and I've Starting to get kind of quite efficient with it, which is nice. The things like ore that were always like such an annoyance before are becoming less so. You can go up to, f by the way, you can go up to 50 over your weight capacity. 
uh, but you can't... But it slows down for every pound above 50. How fast you can move, including how fast your mounts can move. Finish that. Okay. 57 more. Now I can sleep. Now that I've played this game more, I realize that this house is pretty, but really not functional. It's like right in the way of everything, and the pals have no fucking clue how to handle things like buildings and stairs. They just start to freak out really quickly. They get stuck in doors, like you saw with the pink glitter earlier and stuff. It's not a good sight. <laughs> Okay, so everyone's clear and clear, clean, and under control. Uh, what do I get? So, Zen, neutral attack damage, and reduced water damage. I probably want that. And I will replace the Mao, and they will all hopefully go into the... Yep. They'll all go into the ranch, and then they will slowly create coins, bow balls arrows, and flame organs for some reason? Okay, so we can make a high-quality crafting bench now. Someone's gonna come from somewhere. Oh, those are my two miners. Yeah, no, they... <laughs> Okay, they're helping me build from inside the house. Okay, that works, I guess. Weird, but sure. Okay, crossbow. I should be able to make that pretty easy. The question is how hard it is to make the rare one. The problem is that's probably going to need like 10 ancient parts. No, it doesn't! It only needs four, which is how many I have. So I just need a bunch of ingots. And the every time you get some a better rarity thing, the the damage goes up a lot. So the stats on this I think is 240 damage. A uh, on a common, an uncommon is 360. And I guess going by that guess, I'm gonna say this does 480 damage per shot, which is definitely better. Also, I'm gonna make some pelt armor. So we're going to need some logs and such. The crossbow is by far one of the better weapons I've used. The three-shot bow is nice, but it is not as good as the crossbow. The crossbow does some, like, really solid damage. Just, like, the three-shot bow cannot compare. Okay, so we need 20 more ingots, which are being worked on. We need nails, which I can work on. We need, wait, how many nails do we need? 15. That's 20 nails. Six, that's 16 nails. Over here, please. Finish with nails, will you? I'm going to get rid of those now, because we don't need them. We're going to want to create a medicine bench soon, but that requires more nails. Wait, actually, hold on. Here's what I'm going to do. Oh, I don't have enough right now. Here's what I'm going to do. Now that we have enough, I'm going to make 20 nails, because we'll need some for the medicine bench anyways. Ow. Damn it. So we still need the medicine bench till so that we can do shit. To uh upgrade the thing, that's what the upgrade the base. OK, 
Okay, so the Edison Bench is only going to require some nails and some Paldeum. It's going to take a little bit of time for us to get through all the nails and to get through all of the... Um, whatever the hell this stuff is. Ingots, yes. I'm going to need a lot of ingots. So, plus they're also going to need to keep logging so that we have enough wood too. Another problem. So we're probably going to go do something else while they do their thing. Is there wood here? Oh my god, there's 709 wood here. That's why no one's transporting stuff. Okay. 800 wood. Okay, we don't need wood anymore. <laughs> we are good. You might even say we are wood. No, don't ever say that. That is awful. I'm gonna move this over. Almost have enough nails for the medicine bench, I think. Yeah, we don't have the Paldeum. I just want to check again how much the, uh, the, uh, crossbow needs. We're gonna cancel this for a second. Okay, we want... Wait, what just happened? Oh, right, okay, I got confused for a second. No, I, need, I do need a single primitive workbench. Okay, we're gonna do the nails on the primitive workbench instead, because that'll be faster. Work on that. Okay, so the crossbow, we're going to need a ton more ingots and a bunch more nails. Nails are being worked on. Ingots will be done soon. Okay. In the meantime, let us go find things to catch and such. Where do we want to go? Where will be fun? We're low 15 now, so we can go up to the Pen King. I don't know if we're strong enough, but we can try. He's low 15 too. Hopefully, we aren't going to be so far away that they're just not going to be working at all, but that is a risk. Uh, let's see. Hmm. The one that I really want to put up against the Pen King would be Dazzy, and she's only level 10. Let's see if I can get a few levels on her first, and then I'll come after the Pen King, actually. That's probably the safer bet. Where are pals I can fight? Why is this area deserted? Premise. Okay, level 11. Good. That's fast. <laughs> no, I went off a second. You can fight each other. I have it pretty yet. I might as well catch it if I'm if it's no difference between capture and kill, really. Okay. Already pretty close to level twelve. This is an awkward spot to take a giant deer. Ah. No. Maybe I can't, came to the wrong place, because there's not really going to be many pals around here, I think. 
Just based on the weird terrain. That didn't work. Oh, I'm back here again. Let's see. Oh, there's some rush ores over here. Good. Really hoping that wouldn't kill. How do you fend it off with a 39% capture rate? Come on. I've hit things that have like a 3% capture rate. Level up. Okay. Dizzy or whatever it's called is level 12 now. Oh, and that is in the ground now. Ready. You're good XP. To be fair, a lot of my creatures need XP because I just hit 16 now. And it's usually, I usually struggle to keep up with the leveling of my creatures, so. The fact that they're all below my level does suggest that I need to keep leveling them pretty badly. This isn't awful damage, but it's not nearly as good damage as the crossbow. Because, like, if I hit with all three of these shots, they're, like, 20 each, so that's, like, 60. But the crossbow can very easily hit, like, 250 just on the common one. Oh, got him. Nice. Did anyone learn anything? Stun Blast, nice. Okay, my Dazzy's slowly leveling up. Oh, right, that's Stun Blast. I do not like Stun Blast. <laughs> Here, might as well catch both of you. I have more, more than enough pal spheres. And the Vixies keep getting more, so... And I keep finding more. That move's really useful if you can shotgun something with it. But if you're not shotgunning it, it's basically useless. I put Shry Lightning on my deer in my personal game, and I'm probably going to do something similar in this game. I honestly find Shry Lightning to be really good. Don't know if I have one. Going to catch you. Oh, that was my first Malpaca. Nice. I'm 17 already. 14 on Dazzy. Ah. Eh. Stay out of my way. 
Okay. Well, we accidentally wandered into the next area, I think. Can I... Can I please ride you? Cool. I don't know why that was not working. Warp speed. I do not know how I missed that. Oh right, I need to feed my pal team. I keep forgetting that because I'm used to having a feed bag, which auto feeds things based on your current food. Try to draw some creatures where I can. Rush. That was the wrong dodge direction. I'm trying to dodge the left. Also, leather's good. Now, we can go through the gates, but that's the next area, which is starts at 17, I think. Ugh. I need to make sure I don't hit the Mammarist, or I'm going to be very upset with myself. Oh, God. Why did you do that, dear? I have taken down a Mammarist before at level 20, but... I had to use my entire party and, like, a whole ton of shit because it has stuff like that. Okay, we are going home. You are not strong enough to deal with that, nor am I. Happy I teleported before it powerbombed us again. Okay. Are we good? No, I need the nails. Rare crossbow, yeah! Go get it. So many pal spheres. So many pal spheres. Yes. 22. Let's be back up to 45. Okay. I cook some of that now. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on a second. I, there's something I can be doing right now besides this. Oh, I don't have the Paldia. Never mind. I was going to tell them to craft the Medicine Bench, but that's going to be a moment. I need to go get the 10 Paldia for it. Which is often found in the cave dungeons, honestly. You can find giant rocks of it. And once you have a rush ore to use, it tends to go really quickly. Very easy to bring back, like, 50 Paldium. Okay, so who needs food? Rush or Rush or is 80 or 60. Yeah, I can benefit from that. 
No one else is down far enough to justify anything else. Oh my gosh, that's so slow. 250 work speed, 250 percent work speed too. That's very slow for getting help. So the penguin only has handiwork level. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think I think we're going to just ignore this for a little while and go bother the Pen King now. I don't have any other I do have another electric light. Okay. I'll let them continue to craft. It's level 50, and I should be able to take it down with electric types. I just need to not die myself. If I die, that's the pro that's that's the biggest concern is that I will die in the fight, and then I have to start over. But I know none of my pals will even come close to being damaged by it. There we go. I did not expect that to hit me. Okay, I have to be really careful because these things are also dangerous. It doesn't matter that they're just small ones, they are still dangerous. Uh, hmm. I might need something more powerful. Okay, go spark it. Yeah, I might not be strong enough for this. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I can't... My damage output's not high enough. I think I need the crossbow before I can do that. I was gonna do that to wait for the crossbow, but... Oh well. I, mean, I could try one more time. Either it works or it doesn't work. You know what? I'll try it, but this time... I'm just going to throw out my deer. Screw trying to do anything else. Actually, no. Even better. I'm going to try to use the uh, recoil on it instead. Okay, now the deer. Now deer time. Nope. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, not durable enough. That's unfortunate. Ooh. Okay, Pinglet's on a break, wherever the hell that is. Can I pick you up? No. Is Pinglet stuck in the wall again or something? No, Pinglet's here, okay, whatever. Yeah, I'm too weak for the Pen King fight still. That's fair. The problem is, like, I need to be able to survive, and I can't take down all the little penglets while dealing with the Pen King. 
if I had the... If I had the crossbow, I might be able to take down the pangolets, but I don't know if my attack damage is high enough. Still. Yeah, lift mark. I think what we're going to do is we're going to try to finish the crossbow. And then we're going to come back, give it another try, and then the stream will end the stream. If the if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. We have been going for three and a half hours already. Can I get someone else to help us? Can I help ask you to help too? Wait, I can't get both of you to help? Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. It takes so long to craft, but honestly, this is going to be a huge deal. As my damage should be going up by eight times by doing this, because I should be going from about 60 to 480 damage per shot. And that, that 60 assumes that I hit with all three arrows as well. The crossbow is much easier to hit with, seeing as you only have one arrow to hit to get maximum damage. Oh man, this is a long stream. Longer than I usually stream for, but... I don't know, I really like Pal World, so I wanted to fit it in too. It hasn't been doing amazingly on the channel. Uh, the newest short has done well, though, which has been nice. If any of y'all happen to be on the channel and see a Pal World video, I would love it if you would uh, give it a watch and like it. That would help the... That would help me manage to... That would, that would help me give the algorithm a reason to keep checking out my stuff and putting it in front of people. Yeah, one of the shorts is amazing, actually. Okay, I think the cat does worse when they're hungry. I think in general they just do worse when they're hungry. So you are getting a steak. Then you are going back to work. I don't know if that helped. Probably have to check him into the hot tub after this, because his sanity is pretty low. Or sayity? I don't know why there's an N, because apparently it's sayity. I don't even know what that means. Hey, you. You have done very well. Which is why you're going this way now. It's weird that the fox is in the firefox is in the water, but live your best life.
406, okay. That's still really good. Yeah, the, the attack damage of the three-shot bow is 40, and this is 406, so that's 10 times the damage. So much nicer. 1,500 damage! Wow! Headshots are great. I might be able to just, like, one-shot the pangolets with that. Okay, so... If I'm going to be using the deer, I want to have a Kremis on the team, because while in team increases attack power of neutral pals, which includes the deer. So I'm going to replace that. So I'm probably not going to use anyone else. Um... Drops berries. I don't think of anyone who who increases the power of grass. Though, if I'm lucky, maybe the lift monk recoil is actually a neutral move. Okay, let's see. Let's try this again. This time, we are going to go in with a lot more damage. So the first thing I'm going to do is deal with use the Lift Monk Recoil, and then I'm going to swap to the Deer. My mistake the last time was focusing on the Pen King immediately, which I shouldn't have done. I should have taken out the Penglets, because their damage stacks up really quickly. Nope, not that. I want this. Okay, that's all the pangolets down, which is the biggest problem that I had before. Whoa, what the hell was that? I don't know what they're doing, but I don't care. As long as I'm not being attacked, I can keep dealing damage. I think I'm too far away, so I'm not dealing much damage, but it's enough. It doesn't matter. It's enough. No! I didn't see the, uh, the circle on the ground. No, 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 not you. I am glad I dodged that. No! Now I throw it. Damn, I wasted a great sphere. I hate that. Or mega sphere. Yes, I caught him! Oh boy. Man. Okay, we have a water type now. I got dicey for a bit, but it really shows the difference in power having a decent weapon adds. Because that crossbow was definitely was the reason that I survived that. Was taking out all that shit. All the extra pinglets was really a big thing. Plus the deer actually, the AI decided to focus on the pinglets that time, which Definitely also helped, so... All in all, it worked out pretty well. Pretty happy. Okay, I think we're gonna end the stream here. We leveled up five times.
so far today. I still intend to, uh, gonna mainly be streaming Path, but I'm gonna try to fit in Pal World wherever I can. That is kind of my plan right now. I really like Pal World. If it does at all decent on the channel, I will continue to do it. Uh, if it starts to, like, tank my views, then I might have to stop, but we'll see. It seems to be doing quite well just with the shorts, so I'll probably be mostly focusing on doing the shorts and not any long videos. But, yeah, that's about where I'm at. So, thank you for those on YouTube. Who, for those on YouTube, thank you for watching. Remember to uh, like and subscribe if you want to see more cool content, and leave a comment if you have any idea for future videos. Thanks a lot.